It's the same form of bizarre mixing device for chemical compounds, and it positively reeks of the fuel fluids I have seen. Uh, yeah, I think, yeah, the fuel fluids I've seen here often before. It is clearly a compound, same volatile has Save volatile, is it really bastard? Yep, bastard of two composite ingredients. I should wager I would find them close by. Thanks for the hint, game. Did I push this button? Nope. I just keep seeing more and more weird machinery and questioning what the heck is going on. But... No time to dilly-dally. I suppose I'll just keep looking around. Hope I don't find any pigs down here. But my luck is probably not on my side. I think I hear something. Well, there's some more cages here anyway. Well, there might not be a that was an electric piggy, wasn't it? Because that one was a cutscene, so that piggy must be important. I do remember, I think I saw something where it had an electric piggy. Great. This is just great. As I go through there. I don't know if I want to go through there yet. I have no choice but to go through there. Okay. Great. This is gonna go well. August 20th. Took delivery of another batch of imbeciles today. They are the sorriest specimens of humanity I've ever seen. No one asks where they go to. The authorities of Bel Bedlam are simply happy to reduce the overcrowding in their teeming, stinking halls. They measure their skulls, check their teeth, they give them lawn up to purify them. Or pacify them. I purify them too, who knows. Here, drink this, you'll be a virgin again. They wait in line, livestock, dull brown eyes and filthy skin. Many soil themselves as they wait. Here, drink this, that'll clean your pants up. <laughs> Into the manipulator they file in silence. I hear the hissing of gas. I hear the dull groaning as teeth are removed, as bones are reset. I hear the pigs screaming. We have removed all the mirrors. After the process, it is their reflections that trouble them the most. Afterwards, when they sleep, I walk amongst them. My children, I whisper to their dreams. You are my children now. I have children once again, and your forms imperfect will be the engines to make my own blood flow again. What? So yeah, it looks like they were taking criminals and low life essentially and turning them into these monstrosities. Sure. Why not? Over there. Place it in the corner. What? You think I speak Prussian? Do I look like an inbred hog, sir? Who gives a damn what it contains? Just set it down carefully and leave me be! Nope. Oh boy. This door's locked too. Okay, good to know. In that case, I'm just gonna. Wait, this wasn't open before. Who's unlocking the doors for me? The music picked up. It's never a good sign. I hear you, piggy. Oh. Hi! I'm not here, Piggy. <laughs> the 
it's locked. This is bad. Oh. Guess my only option is to run like hell. Or sneak really, really well. Which I don't think I'm able to do very well. Okay, go on. Patrol your little halls. Can I open this and just hide in there and be like, I'm dead. I'm one of you. I'm trapped. Unless maybe they're smarter than that. I don't know. Can I turn my lights back on, please? Where'd he go? They just kind of vanished like the morning mist. Nope. Down I go. Oh, poop. Not again. The lift has been sabotaged. You will have to find another way to the tunnel. Take care in this place, Mandus. It is the crucible of the evil that stalks these corridors. Who are you? I don't trust this guy. Then again, I don't trust the majority of these guys. I'm just saying. The majority of this I don't trust. Oh boy. Or pig? No, no pig. Okay, no pig. Oh. Ghost children, though. That was a weird ass animation. He looked like he was a Scooby Doo character <laughs> running away from the monsters. Cheeky Scoob, we gotta get out of here. If that's not an indication that kids are dead, I don't know what is. More experiments with Compound X. Took the dog and injected it with stri strychnin. After the unexpected convulsions and spasming, it died just after midnight. I immersed the body in a large tank of Compound X and introduced an alternating current via induction coil for a period of three and a half minutes. Partial return was induced. However, damage occurred prior to death was retained upon revival, meaning the dog continued in the acute state of strychnine poisoning until I put a bullet in its skull. But drowning? Perhaps yes. It is after all known to be the kindest of suicides. If one were to drown, Placing the fluid in the lungs with Compound X should theoretically be perfectly possible as a revival method. You killed your dog for science. You, sir, are sick. I mean, it's quite obvious. None of this is normal. But that's pretty lame. And of all ways to kill one with poison, that's pretty freaking low. I put this in here? I do. Okay. What did that do? I don't even know. I'm just kind of wandering through, hoping to figure out what I'm doing. Oh, this is a tight space. Oh, I didn't die. Oh. And do I put it in this one and then shoot it off to another one? No. Oh, I see. Do I put it in here? Do I put it in here? Do I put it in? Ah, okay. 
So I gotta collect all those little doodads and get things activated. They fell onto his hands and they eroded in front of me. To stumps. To stumps. Next time we will use an equal mix of infusion vita and orgone disperser. No, no, just take him out. You can dump him in the river for all I care. Charming. Okay. Ooh, what's this say? A warning. Inflamed it is, burning it does, bleeding from each hole, poor and aft, leaking down my legs, blood and excrement. My lungs are in my vomit. I pass clots of my organs now onto the filthy stone. Drink this, he says, and I did drink it. I did do that because of the changes. They ripple inner me. My teeth sneeze out and scatter like mice in the dark. I cannot find them all, gather what I can, push them back into my gray gums with my fingers, but the nails are all weepy and falling out. Drink it, he says. It'll help the running of the fever because not a all could take the change on the other, on the other table. A beast under a blanket. I never wanted to see under that, but he drank it too. He passed it under the blanket and I heard it drink. Dear God Almighty, how can a man shed so much blood and still live? Huh. That's interesting. Disturbing, more like it, but, uh, yeah. Okay. Was that another pig? I know, it's warning me, but I'm kind of like, I don't know if I want to just listen or... Oh, it's behind me, isn't it? Ah! Okay, I'm just gonna hold on for a minute while I read this. It's some floor bizarre mixing device for chemical compounds. It's positively reeks of the... Oh, never mind. Running, 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 running. Uh... Oh, sure, you're not gonna call me now. Ugh. Oh, that happened. Although I'm fairly certain I still have more to do. Because, uh... I'm nowhere near being done. Or I had just enough, I don't know. Alright, what does this say? I have the compound, it hisses and steams in its container like some living thing. A witch's jelly to burn and, cor in, to burn and corrode. The container is made from glass, a strangle choice, or a strange choice. Unless there is some particular reason why the metal that pervades everywhere cannot be brought into contact with this so-called Compound X. I should investigate further into this. Okay. So is this what I use up there? On the door over- on the lock over here. That's what I'm assuming I have to use it with. Well, I mean, I, I used it. I used the battery.
Like, can I take the needles out of the frog? What am I missing here? There must be a reason why I can move this la- Ah, oh, that's it! Needs to be melted. So now can I take this off? I mean, I just melted it, so shouldn't that have done something? I'm about to keep melting it. Oh, okay, that's what I'm doing. There we go! Got it! Well, that's one problem solved. Took way longer than it should have, but eh. I'm going as fast as I can, dead children. Ow. My knees. Okay, well, I don't think I need to go back up, so... Down to the hole I go. This leaking world. All these nails and no wood. What kind of a carpenter are you? That figure cannot help but open its arms to you. Where is the strength in that? Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. <coughs> well, that looked like fun. Ew, hi, Patches. What? S excuse me, I'm in the middle of something. But, you're probably right. This is probably a good place to stop it off for now. Because we got a lot done. A bit of muddling around, too, but either way, we got a lot done. We're still very confused, and we're still getting chased by pig monsters. Just keeps getting better and better. But... We'll worry about that in the next episode. For now, this is Star Princess HLC saying thank you very much for watching and have a fond farewell. Mm -hmm.